Now, you read the names on this clip, and you're thinking, Jesus, Joe, are you serious? Well, I got a story about this, because of course it's story time with Joe. Years ago in the 80s, even before I went to work at the paper, I had a week of vacation. A couple days, I think a long weekend I took, and um, my Hanai brother Mark and his girl and I flew to Seattle to for a weekend to go to the A's games in Seattle at the Kindo. Well, the gal's sister worked for one of the airlines, so she flew up separately from us. We flew up on Alaska, which still had breakfast in the morning. It was awesome. Anyway, um, we went to the ball games. I think a three. I, seems to me we flew up Friday and then flew home Sunday night after the Sunday day game. Um, we went to the Rainier Brewery and we're going to take the tour. Well, at the beginning or the end of the tour, and I think it's the beginning, you go to the reception area and there's a guest book. It, well, by God, it has to be the beginning because we wouldn't have stayed, you know. If it was at the end of the tour, we'd have left. But um, uh, there's a guest book. So I sign my name and then my brother Mark signs a name. He doesn't sign his name. He signs the name Dick Gozinia, D-I-C-K-G-O-Z-Y-N-A, and it's exactly as I pronounced it. Now, we're a bunch of immature little kids, and I don't, you know, I don't see it, so Mark calls me, me over and points it out, and it's at the top of the beginning of the next page. So, we're laughing so hard we could hardly see straight. So, we sit down, and we're waiting for our turn at the tour, and Mark's gal is noticing that, you know, she knows us and she knows something's up. And she figures out that every time somebody goes up to sign their name, you know, you read the names and stuff before you, well, they figure it out and they get a real sour look on their face. And then Mark and I are laughing so hysterically, we, we're about ready to pee our pants. Well, the gal was not really happy when she figured out what, what her boy did, so... We were waiting probably 20 minutes, and honest to God, I'm 59 years old, and I have never, ever in my life laughed that hard and that long. My sides hurt, and I was exhausted from laughing so hard. And every time I'd look at my brother, he'd look at me, and we start laughing some more. It was just, it was just a force of fire. It was so contagious. <laughs> now, my, uh, my brother says that when they, when he goes to places and they want his name and they want to get him on the mailing list and stuff he uses names like that because then when the mail comes he knows it's in so and so's name uh, Dick Gozinias and it's junk mail which I thought was an outstanding idea so anyway that's the story about the Rainier Brewery I got a couple of other Seattle stories that I'll, I'll probably end up talking about because I decided that instead of putting this just on Facebook I'm going to start telling my stories. I'm going to put them on YouTube. And by God, I think I'm a pretty good storyteller. And, you know, either you're interested or you're not. So if you are, then by God, I have some pretty funny stories to tell. If not, then, meh, okay, you know, okay. So there you go.